today I am at Epcot because I hear they have some fantastic annual pass holder exclusives, a little secret dessert, and some surprising discounts that they have not offered before. So, let's go do this. Talk about a surprisingly slow day. Frozen Ever After is only a 40 minute wait. And actually the highest wait out of all the attractions in the park is Test Track at 45 minutes. Soren is only 15 minutes. Living with the land is closed. And uh, oh, Grand Fiesta Tour, five minutes. I guess first thing on the list is to head into the land to check out the secret dessert that they're exclusively offering to annual pass holders. I've seen some pictures of it online already, but I really want to try it. I want to know what it tastes like. It looks like it's delicious, but I want to know if it's delicious. So the location for the super secret dessert is going to be at Sunshine Seasons. Ooh, that's kind of like a tongue twister. Sunshine Seasons. Sunshine Seasons. Sun, 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 sunshine seasons. There we go. What an awesome planet. Wow, I got super nervous that maybe they closed. There's nobody down here. Huh. Who do I talk to about the super secret dessert? Okay, you want one? Yes. Okay. Super secret annual pass holder dessert. There it is. There it is. The annual pass holder secret dessert. It looks like it's a sugar cookie with vanilla gelato and chocolate drizzle on top. I'm excited. And it actually was pretty cheap. Only $4.68 with your annual pass holder discount. Not too shabby. That does not include the annual pass. I'm gonna take that back now just pretty for the photo op. Is this something you eat with a fork or is this something you just you just go for it? I mean, it is an ice cream sandwich, but honestly, that is huge, isn't it? I'm going to I'm going to go for it. I mean, I don't know what else to say. Oh boy. Look at that. Oh yeah. Nope. You cannot eat that like an ice cream sandwich. Well, you can't take one big bite out of it. It is way too thick. So I guess you gotta kinda just like nibble away at it. Oh yeah, that is delicious look at that look at the cookie oh it is really good and the gelato is really good too it definitely gets my stamp of approval I do have to say it does make quite a mess so be careful one thing about this dessert that I just don't understand is it's pre-made and it's sitting in the freezer but how do they freeze it without the cookies getting hard like the cookie is soft how is it staying soft like if you freeze cookies they get hard right but no like the cookie is soft and the ice cream or the gelato is hard which makes it like a very good uh like texture i like it a lot now that we have officially determined that the secret annual pass holder dessert is indeed delicious we are going to head to World Showcase to show you some other cool annual pass holder exclusives. But it's not dark outside. It did start raining. Raindrops falling on my head. Well, I thought I was taking the quick route over to World Showcase and then this big wall showed up. So I'm going to have to <laughs> go in here and then come out the other side and they got this all blocked off. Must be getting ready for food and wine. Speaking of food and wine, I did talk to the girl that works at Sunshine Seasons, and they said that the uh, annual pass holder special dessert is probably gonna be available all the way up until that time, or until it actually sells out by popular demand. I tell you what, I love it when it rains. Look at this. Everybody, there's wide open spaces. This is definitely a prime example of my crowd uh, calendar. How to tell when it's actually busy at Disney World. And that's if you can run around in a circle without bumping into people. 
I've got a slight confession. I like the smell of wet ponchos. <laughs> and look at that. Getting ready for food and wine, August 29th. I'm gonna be very excited. There's a lot of cool things coming and I am stoked. I think that was the first time I've ever said stoked. An actual sentence. <laughs> look at those gondolas scooting by. It's like the boat's waiting from the pass. Up, up, there it goes, double transportation. Love it. So our next annual pass holder exclusive is going to be a discount because now they offer 10% discount on alcohol at Block and Hans and Fife and Drum, which is pretty awesome because, you know, you don't get that. I mean, you get tables in Wonderland for sit-down services, but 10% is 10% and I'm all in. We can get a beer flight, some local light lager, some American Beauty Pale Ale, 10%, hey. So the beer flight's only $9.50. Huh, I'm thinking. So I decided to get the Kentucky Vanilla Barrel Cream Ale. It's $9.50, saved myself a dollar. A dollar, I say. One more super awesome annual pass holder perk that they got going on is reserved seating for Guardians of the Galaxy Awesome Mix Live. You get actually these nice two front rows there. All for your annual pass holders. Nobody actually came for the show though, so they actually like took down the sign and just opened it up to everybody. But it's pretty awesome that they do give you that reserved spot. I'm not gonna stay and watch the show because I did just see the show I think last week or the week before because there is something else I want to show you guys. Another annual pass holder perk. So we're gonna move along. To oh. and the America Garden Thank you! I don't know if I got to tell you guys that I made a very wise decision with getting the Kentucky Vanilla beer because they don't actually include it in the flight. I was going to get the flight, but the fact that this was missing out, I am very happy that I got it because it is delicious. I guess enough with the beer though because we are at the Italy Pavilion and over here they actually have a photo pass opportunity just for annual pass holders. So I wanted to catch that before the actual sun went down. So we need to find ourselves a photo pass photographer. I know they're around here somewhere. Am I fogging up? Ooh, ooh. Hey bus. Hey, sorry. How are you? Good. Are you doing the annual pass holder uh, photo opportunity? Uh, this was more during the way on tonight shots. So I don't have the button. Oh no! Yeah. I missed it. Yeah. Well, I guess we're gonna have to chalk that up to a fail because they aren't doing the annual pass holder photo pass opportunity at night. It's only a daytime thing, but it is here on the bridge at Italy. And uh, I don't know, I guess I'll just have to improvise. Great Gatsby's. Well, I think that's going to do it for me. I'm sorry I wasn't able to show you guys the annual pass holder photo pass opportunity, but I hope my shots actually made up for it a little bit. I'll definitely come back and check it out. And there are a couple of other offerings that they are giving for annual pass holders, including a free dessert if you're dining at Coral Reef. But we didn't dine there today, so I couldn't show you that. But other than that, lots of cool stuff happening at Epcot, and I absolutely had a blast here today. So, love the life you live, and we'll see you next time. Bye! I, I did that so they could see like the spaceship Earth right now.